Hello YouTube. Welcome to episode 11 to Hard Time. I actually don't remember what happened in the last episode. Um, oh yeah, Lord Gollins has been found dead. His untimely death was it thought to be related to its free the Turner Pike. Oh wow. Did I really kill him? I don't remember. Hey, everybody, I know that you were responsible for warning God's death. He was a dear friend of mine, and I won't rest until you pay for what you've done. That you deserve to treat of you and I quote you. <clears throat> I remember something. Yeah, I killed him in the hospital, didn't I? Yeah. I got off his arm and they accused me of assaulting a warden. And then yeah. Hey, turn back. I'm getting out of here soon. I just wanted to say goodbye before I leave. Oh crap, I'm gonna die. Probably. Oh yeah. I don't even be dying today. Oh crap, I'm gonna die. I got my sanity back. Oh, what should I do? I should study. Yeah, I'm way too strong. I should study. And I'm not very smart, so I should study. Since a new inmate called Mr. Smith will now occupy the cell 10 of the South Block. Oh, come on. You screwed up, Turner Pike. That's the last time I asked you to do something for me. Well, he can't give me extra days, but he can just tell me that, oh, you screwed up. Since he's not a guard anymore. Yeah, one, one guard turned into a prisoner for being corrupt. I should probably give it to myself. No! Oh crap. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Okay, good. Ah, uh, you little one. I love the very hot pencil negative. Are you stronger than me or something? Is that why you're saying that?
new officer called Warden Austin will now occupy now patrol East Block area. The guard that I did kill was in the clinic. He was in the infirmary. Yeah, I'm gonna work out with a dumbbell. I'm going to sleep. <clears throat> I know it isn't time, but still, I need my sleep. All right, my intelligence is at 60 percent. You said I got it to that high. <clears throat> Thirty-one days left. Yep. I served a four day sentence for that one thing now. I don't remember what that was. Oh yeah, dealing. Yeah, what happened there was I took the blame for someone else and then they took all my money. Yeah, that's what happened. Yeah, he paid me $480 and then everything's like gone. Because I, I got a call for dealing. <laughs> and the judge didn't like me at all, actually. <laughs> yeah, this is quite a weird game, you know. Attention all inmates called Tim Hawksberry is it will now occupy cell ten of the East Block. Attention prisoner S006, otherwise known as Jerry Kiljo, has been released. Alright man, he served his sentence for probation for prostitution and we now welcome him back into society. Oh, he was also a prostitute. Hey Turnipike, I know that you were responsible for Warden Samus' death. He was a dear friend of mine, and I won't rest until you pay for what you've done. No. <clears throat> yeah, I'm going to wait for phone calls, and now I'm going to go to canteen an hour before dinner. Yeah, you, here, here's something that I did find out by myself before. That if you're in the canteen on the exact 13 hour, then food will show up on the table. So, oh, that guy just got seriously injured. He lose a, is he lose a limb? No, he didn't. Everybody got all their limbs. Are you a member of the Perks? I've always wanted to join that gang. Do you think it, you could find a place for me? I'm sure I'd be a great asset to the cause. Hmm. You know, this is the part where you could mess up and actually lose your spot in the gang. Okay, if they don't like him, if they don't want him, and you say recruit a member, they will 
get rid of you, but if you say no, forget it, and they and it actually turns out that they are a good member, and they'll they'll kick you out. So it's either a 50-50 chance right here. I'm gonna recruit him because he's fat and he looks like he got muscle. Great, you won't regret this. I promise. I'll do anything for the perks. Peace. Oh, phone call. Listen, I'm a filmmaker, and I'd like to make a project about uh, the rise and fall of a criminal. Fail of a criminal. Would you be interested in talking part if I paid you $570 for the rights to your story? Yeah, I'll accept. Thanks for taking part, and I'm sure the public will be fantastic by your life story. Yeah, you lose reputation from accepting it. I hope the money was worth it, you rat. Nobody around here will trust you again. Yeah, the money was worth it. Alright. $570, you couldn't pass that up. Hey, turn up, I hear you've been having trouble with Warren Bishop. <laughs> I can take care of him if you want. Just give me $250 and he'll be no and he'll never bother you again. No thanks. Maybe it's you that deserves a beating. What a bishop would pay to see that. Is he gonna die? Uh oh, he's so close to die. Yeah, if I hit him, I could be accused of his death. Yeah, people could accuse me of his death if I hit him at all. He's probably gonna die, though. Hey, Turnpike, you think you're a big man because you're doing time for drug dealing? Oh, now I get the drug dealing charge. Well, screw that because I'm in here for assault, and that's even worse. <laughs> Dude, you're not in the right mood to actually be fighting me, alright? Your health is definitely low. You got problems with your health. And you could die pretty soon here. Alright? So you don't want to pick a fight with me. I'm telling you that right now. You're, you don't even want to pick a fight with me right now. Because I'd just beat you to death. Wouldn't I? Yeah, I would. I would. I so would. Is he paralyzed? Right when I said that, he moves. He can probably hear me. Oh, I don't know. Oh, really? Hi, Turtlepike. It's your lawyer speaking. I've got some good news about your case. One of those idiot idiots messed you up your paperwork, so we should be able to claim back a day. Calm in back a day. The only problem is, well, need $220 to file an appeal. Do you want to wire me the money? Yes, pay. Alright, I've got, I'll get 
into it immediately. You just sentence should be down to just 30 days. Alright, a 30 day sentence now. 30 more days in prison. Great. Turn it back. I'm not scared of you. Your status makes you a target to me. The only thing wrong with having a reputation is that I can earn one by kicking your ass. Do you really want to fight with me? Hey, turn it back. I saw what you did. Hey, I could send you down for a long time. No, I don't care. Fine, have it your way. When the warrants hear my version of the story, they'll throw you away the town. You almost killed Dave Evans, you animal. You're under arrest for attempted murder. Fine. Catch me then. Send me to prison even more. We're gathered here to hear the case against prisoner E005. So, Warden Bishop, what's the story? The animal viciously attacked Dave Evans and left the poor man fighting for his life. I never intended to hurt Dave Evans. It was a disagreement that got out of him. Yeah, that's pretty much what happened. That is pretty much what happened. It was a disagreement that got out of hand. Okay, you can both stop bickering all set of this. Just give me a minute to think over the facts. After hearing each of your statements and reviewing the evidence, this court rules in favor of... Warden Bishop. Oh, come on. It's a miracle that Dave Evans survived your vicious a threat to your fellow inmates. You deserve to be behind bars for another five days, and I'll order and I order you to pay one thousand in medical fees. What? Well, really? One thousand dollars? Yo, Kitty. Lose all this money. Attention, a new officer called Warden Matt and have will now patrol the hospital area. Finally, finally there's an officer for that. Hey Turnpike, thanks for getting rid of Warden and Samson. I wish I'd done it myself. Hey, there's a new king in town and his name is Young Boy. Watch your step around me. Okay. Um, how do you get the glared king? Like, that's what I don't really get. How do they get the glared king? Don't listen to that judge turnpike. His guilty verdict makes you innocent to us. It's the ones that come back from court without doing their time that you have to be suspicious of. 
Have you heard about Tim Hawkeye's death? I guess he finally got what was coming to him. Right there to buy good call on Iron Mick. None get it stronger by the day. Hey, turn it back. I hear you got a problem with if most uh, we well he's a friend of mine if he doesn't like you I don't like you either so you better watch your back all right it's not 13 o'clock yet hey turn the bike I know that you were responsible for one Samson's death he was a dear friend of mine and I won't rest until you pay for what you've done I'm gonna just sit right here and wait for the food. Hopefully food comes up on this table. Yep. See, you can just do that. I think food shows up on every tray. It's just that some people eat the food. No, maybe not. Maybe people have eaten the food. I don't know. Maybe it shows up full on every single tray. But maybe people have eaten the food. Or maybe they're just not eating. Oh, well, there's some food. Oh wait, you can also gain intelligence by doing some jobs. Maybe I got enough intelligence to do this job. You also need intelligence to do certain jobs. Yeah, some jobs you need more intelligence. Yeah, I, I don't have enough intelligence. Ooh, phone call. Hey, Darn Park, I hear you're doing a good job of representing the peaks in there. I want you out of prison as soon as possible so that I can put you to work on the street. Oh, really? I'm gonna be working on the street after I get out of prison. You know, I'm in here for attempted murder now. Have you heard about Tim Huckabee's death? I guess he finally got what was coming to him. Intelligence. Hey, turn it back. You must be retarded. I've never met anyone as stupid as you. You used to be a cop. Really? You gonna be saying that? You're the one in the study. You're the one in the study all the time. Like. Your face makes you look retarded. Like, that's the thing. Look at your face. It just makes you look retarded. Can I, can I see your face from right here? Can I? I don't think I can. I don't think it can go that far. 
You know, his sanity seems to be going down a lot lately. Could him not having money be a problem with that? Yeah, could him not having... Yeah, he's in debt right now, so maybe him not having money is probably... Somewhat to do with the sanity going down so fast lately. Right there, in fact, I'm not scared of you. Your stats makes you a target to me. The only thing wrong with him is. Look, my sanity's not not quite up there, so I can't control myself. Don't worry, Turner. I I won't get a a ton class son for what he did to you. Oh crap! Oh good, my sanity's back up. It's time for the peaks to go. The gladiators rule this place now. The bet you better bear your troops because we're gonna wage war until there's only one gang left. What? No, don't die. Okay, good. That was very. The cop was the one who had that gun. I didn't do nothing wrong. Now I got shot, I don't, and I almost died. Where's his attempted murder warrant? Yeah, I need to spend my whole time studying. That's what I need to do. I need to spend my whole time just studying. Just staying time in the study. Alright. After this day. Oh yeah, I can use brim. I get some money. Your actions have brought shame to us. This is the end for you. We miss, we wish you luck with your rehabilitation, but I'm afraid it cannot continue under our banner. Ah, oh, it took me out. Why? Why did you take away my room, though? Hey, turn up like you. I don't know. Look, I don't. I don't want to deal with anyone right now. All right, just get out of my cell. Get out of my cell. All right, 34 days left.
Alright, so that was the timer. Yep, that was the timer to go, so. I'll end the episode right here.